What's up guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Tim. And I'm Millie. We're gonna be doing a Chick-fil-A mukbang. We're gonna eat and we decided we're gonna talk to you guys and just kind of fill you guys in what's going on with us, our lives, things we're trying to decide, decisions mm -hmm. we're trying to make. And what better way to do it than to do it while eating over some food and just talking to y'all. We're gonna talk to y'all like just real and open. Yeah, so let's do a thumbnail. So, um, let's talk about what we got to eat first. Yeah. Let's get right into it. What did you get to eat, babe? And then I'll share what I, I got, got to eat. I got the little mini chicken nuggets. She got an eight. Oh, there you go. An eight count. I got the spicy deluxe because I'm a fat ass. That looks good. So we haven't eaten all day. We skipped breakfast because we rushed out on the road this morning to get some stuff done. And today's Saturday is my treat day. Oh, it's a cheat day. Cheat yeah, day it's been a friend. cheat day for If you haven't been to Chick-fil-A yet, you got to try the food. Oh, the fries are the best. The fries. And we, and got, we got a, a soup to share. A chicken, chicken tortillas. Chicken tortilla soup. Let me show you guys what it looks like. That thing is huge. Everything's falling out. So it's got tortillas to put in there. Yeah. So anyways, we about to grub. And you can't, yo, if you go to Chick-fil-A, you have to get like... Their lemonade. Yeah, the lemonade's on point. And the ice, you better eat the ice because I can just eat all the ice. So they had all the ice. Oh, flop. <laughs> Sorry, guys. We're using an actual phone today because we didn't plan on even doing this. So we're using a phone. Hopefully, the quality is good enough. So, so we got some sweet and spicy sriracha sauce. Yeah, we got like almost all the sauces Polynesian sauce, Chick fil A sauce. Damn, you gotta bring it right. close. Chick-fil-A sauce and some herb garlic ranch. So I don't know. I'm gonna dig in. I'm gonna take some of Millie's food. No, you ain't. <laughs> so, anyways, well, today mm. we were we left out early. We we every Saturday we try to hit up some garage sales. Just for some of y'all that don't know, we do some reselling. So we like to go to garage sales and um, sometimes some stores like Walmart and look for stuff to resell. So we did that. We started off the day doing that. And then we were driving and we've been thinking about like over the past couple weeks, um, what we want to do with like overall, like do we want to continue living in an RV for the next couple years or do we want to settle down? Mm -hmm. So I think we'll start off talking about that. Like, is, are we up in the air with it? Like we kind of want to settle We've been down. wanting to settle in now. But then again, we don't. We just want to keep traveling. So we were thinking about we either do that, find we us. We still have so much to see, that's why. Yeah, either we're going to find a state to settle in mm -hmm. and um, settle down for a little while. Keep the, well, keep the RV. Mm -hmm. We're still going to have the RV or whatever, but we, um, we're kind of in mixed feelings with wanting stability or just wanting to continue and travel. And this sauce is on point. This is the... Yeah. What is that one? The honey mustard? Mmm, that honey mustard is good. So we're kind of stuck in between those feelings. Like, do we want to settle down? Do we want to continue to travel? So we're looking at some options. We have a truck. We got this truck in 2016. And it's about time to where I think I want to trade it in. Just because it can only pull so much uh, weight. Talk and, and eat. Talk and eat. Oh, shit. I got to eat. So we, 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 I'm trying to decide if I want to trade a truck in. Things are running out. The warranty running out. Things like that. Oh my god, look at this. That burger looking kind of right. No burger, bro. Oh, it's a heart attack on a burger. Damn, it looks good. Mmm. 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 Mm. 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 We're trying to decide, yo, like, <laughs> should we get another truck? Should we get a bigger RV? Because we ain't gonna lie, we could do it some more space. So, well, what's happening is we're realizing that in the RV that we're currently in, we've had some issues. Yeah, we've had some problems with the we've RV that we have to get fixed. And now that we're here in Fresno, the reason we are in Fresno is obviously to avoid winter. And um, to work. It's still cold as hell. It's still cold, but That's it's not not um, snowing or anything like that. It's just cold. Yeah, and the reason for that is our next stop was supposed to be Oregon, but we can't go to Oregon yet because the weather's crazy. Yeah, it's too cold and it's too rainy. When you're living in an RV, you have to worry about condensation inside of your RV. So meaning if you breathe too hard, you can get mold in your RV. <laughs> yeah. 
Is this because of the cold air outside and then it's warm inside? Mm. Oh shoot, I forgot about the Chick-fil-A sauce. Mm. I like to dip this in my, use this for my fries. I think um, Chick-fil-A got the best fries besides McDonald's. I ain't gonna lie, I like the waffle fries. Yeah. Anyway, get back to it yesterday, sorry. I lost my train of thought. Since we've had all these problems with the trailer and we've had warranty issues, and we're continuing to, it only makes sense for us to upgrade or something. We're trying to decide if we want to upgrade. Mm -hmm. Or just keep it, renovate it, and then have a house. Yeah, we're thinking about keeping it, renovating it, or upgrading to a, a better brand. A better brand, something newer, something with more space. Mm -hmm. With a better layout. Yeah. Now that we've... um. Mm. We're thinking about upgrading. We're thinking, thinking about upgrading to another trailer, a uh, fifth wheel, or that's where the decision comes in. Like, do we want to do this for longer? Now that we've we been veterans around? at this, we know what to look for in RVs and towing capacity and all that stuff. It's much easier to make a decision versus than when we first started. We didn't know what we were doing. We didn't know what kind of RV, what were what were the best. Even though you do your own research, even though you research, it doesn't really matter until you've actually done it does that make sense no why are you taking my fries though i don't know <laughs> at the end of the day the point is that we're trying to decide if we're gonna keep this trailer get another one keep this truck get another one also you know we want to save so getting another truck will be more more of a smart thing to do because mm -hmm. of warranties and maintenance packages and things mm -hmm. like that so it'll be cheaper, of course. So anyway, today we went to a dealership and you know ran some numbers and see what made sense. We found a beautiful truck that we love. It has everything that we need. Yeah, we're just still you know a little undecided if mm -hmm. we want to go that route. That's kind of where our minds have been at. Like we've been kind of you know where do we go next from here? Like this this lifestyle brings a lot of question marks <laughs> yeah you gotta think about a lot we yeah. know we want to go to oregon next like we're thinking about going back east but not right now but why go back east we're already here we still soup. have oregon to see but you gotta show the soup i can't show um, it it'll spill it has look, white beans so it looks like i don't think you can see it that's uh, chicken shredded chicken black beans corn Onions, peppers, and then you it, have this if you want to put it on here. The tortillas. So anyways, that's where we are. Well, we're trying to make some life decisions and what's going to be better for us. Better for our work. Better for the business that we do on the road. You finished all your nuggets? Mm-hmm. You didn't give me one. We ate little pieces in there. Mm-hmm. So yeah, anyway, that's where we're at right now, actually, with our lives. Just trying to decide our next, like, move. You know, and that takes a lot of thought, a lot of planning. Trying to decide what's the best decision right now for our future. I'm actually gonna use one of these um, sauces here. Which one is this? Mm -hmm. Ooh, sweet and spicy. The soup is pretty good. Very they creamy. gave us two of those things. Two what? Tortilla. Two of the tortilla things. Mm. It'll be good if it has some avocado in it. Mm. You had it with the. You tried it with the Chick Fil A sauce. Mm. It really has uses honey mustard for everything. I love honey mustard with my fries. Yeah, so I don't know. That's where we're kind of at, guys. I know we're kind of mumbling and <laughs> rambling on. When we started RV and we were like, we were going to probably do this for like two years maybe. Mm -hmm. Well, we didn't know when we were going to do it for. So we're coming up on it. We're at a mark of two years now. Oh, yeah. And we still want to do it. We love it, but I then again, we also want that sense of stability. It's like we want the stability, but we don't want it. <clears throat> this is all the message. 
It just feels good. What feels good? Stability sometimes. Stability feels good? Maybe we just need to get back on the road. But we gotta wait everything out in Fresno. But, um, yeah, I don't know. The reason we're in Fresno is because, one, it's cheap. Save RV parks money. are cheap here, so save money. You're not in the boonies, technically, because there's every store you can think of. So you have yeah, the park that we're at, you know, we're right in the middle of the city. Well, not downtown, but we're in the middle of, you we're know, everything. So that's a good thing. But yeah, we're shopping around. We went to the, we brought the, we brought the RV in to get some repairs done. Annual, we had to add annual maintenance on it. And then again, we were looking at different RVs there, different which we love, models. different layouts. And Something we fell that has in more love light. With Grand Design. Yeah. Uh, was it, it was a fifth wheel Grand Design. We saw different floor plans. More options, more floor plans. Some some that are that have more space. The chassis is wider. One's about to die. So we have we have options, but we're just at a like like I said before, y'all. So the question is, what do you guys think? Should we remodel or should we upgrade? Yeah. Put it down below if you guys think we should remodel our current RV or should we upgrade? And the reason we haven't remodeled is because. We were still under warranty. When you're under warranty, if you change anything, then you void the warranty. So we don't want to do that. Now that we're off the warranty, now we're thinking of remodeling, ripping things apart, and making it more to our liking. And it's real dark in there too. So it makes it really up. dark. Yeah. So that's why we wanted something that had more windows, that's more that has more light, and that was lighter inside. Usually RVs are like really dark in the inside. I guess like designs. I'm not really sure why they do that, but. They just do. They just do. So I don't know if y'all think we should remodel it, considering all the issues we've had with it, or get rid of it. We also thought about, like I said, the option of getting a home. And if we do get a home, if we get into a house, we can always Airbnb our RV. So that's a plus. Mm -hmm. And then we all we also have it still to travel when we want to. True. So those are options. Like so, there's just a lot of things we're trying to think about. We're trying to weigh out what's going to be better for us in the long run mm -hmm. um i think right now we're still not done with the traveling because we feel like we still got the itch i don't know but well, we still so many... have a lot more to see that we haven't seen we've only done the east coast right. All right, the me, west yeah i'm about to now. finish this i don't know you wanted more so bear with us y'all we're just trying to figure our lives out right now at a point in our life trying to see which direction we want to go next So we're looking to upgrade to a 2500 truck so we'll be able to pull more we have the option to if we do end up upgrading we can upgrade to a fifth wheel or something that is that can you know pull more weight yeah the truck that we we're looking at pulls pulls up to twenty five thousand pounds with a fifth wheel or 17 with 17 thousand with a travel trailer the so. truck we have not only does 10 five mm -hmm. So that's kind of that kind of wraps up everything that we've been kind of thinking about and that's we're, we got a lot on our minds like we're trying to think about the direction this channel is going in yeah. with the recent changes did we make a good i uh, was it a good idea to change it to the name that we have because we found out there's that a show the show that's on that's on youtube it's this is us and then our initials, it kind of makes it not too searchable. Mm -hmm. We're having a hard time with people <laughs> finding us because of that. Yeah, so we're so, thinking about, do, do we make that right decision? Do we change it again? Like, we're just at that point where we're just trying to rethink everything we're doing. Everything from living, from sharing our lives, from just everything. Just give us suggestions, you know, like whatever you guys think. Let us know in the comments below. At the end of the day, you know, we're going to do what we think is best for us, but and your opinions will help us guide us in that direction we also want to know what to name our family like our youtube subscribers you guys are family so we want to know we're also thinking about ideas you know what it should be as far as you know the fat like whatever family or squad or my whatever it is we're also open to suggestions with that we thought about like the mt family or the mt squad or the tm fat like we have stuff that we've thought about but we just haven't really even had the time to think about what we're gonna do about that so 
So this is pretty much a cry for help with decisions. <laughs> It's not necessarily that cry for help. We just let them know like what we're going through right now. What's in our minds. Where where we've been at. That's where we've been. Yeah, so for now I think we're gonna be here for the next three to four months. And then um after that we're gonna be moving on to Oregon. Family wants wants us to settle down on the east. We're not ready to go back to the east. Friends are like, when are y'all coming back? That's where we're at. Help us out with what you guys want us to name our family. We can still do the Mac family. We're thinking about just, I don't know, making our name just Tim and Millie or Millie and Tim. So it's a lot more easy to search. But let us know if that makes sense. I think more than likely we are going to be changing our name to Millie and Tim. Yeah. Just because of the searchable issues that we've been having with this particular um, name, that we have. name and the show. That it's spelled the same way. So we're having a hard time people finding us. Mm -hmm. Um, so yeah, stay tuned for that. We apologize for the inconvenience, but unfortunately, if we're not searchable, that means people are not finding us, and it makes it hard for us to be able to grow that way. We're, we ate all this food. We ate everything. Everything. Even the thing. Well, think about it. It's, it's three o'clock. We left the house at eight, and we didn't. Eat. And we also have a giveaway coming for you guys just to celebrate our 1,000 subscriber uh, milestone. So that's something else that we're planning um, in the midst of everything else. So stay tuned for that, guys. It is coming. It's just going to be like a thank you to everyone that subscribed to our channel. Yeah, so stay tuned for that. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up and hit the notification bell so you guys are notified when we post a new video. All right, guys. So that's going to wrap up the video. If you guys um, haven't checked us out on social media yet, go ahead and do so. Our links will be in the description below. Uh, if you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe or consider subscribing. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Woo!